I'm going to say something to you right now that I've never said to another living soul in my life. The ENTP, or the Contrarian, primarily navigate the world through the abstract realm of ideas. And you'll be in a world of pure imagination. This is supplemented by their inner thoughts. Point 21 gigawatts of electricity. Oh, point 21 gigawatts! 1.21 gigawatts! This combination leads the ENTP to use their logic and analytical skills in service of their fascination with brainstorming. I said no lies. I think he's telling the truth. If he were telling the truth, he wouldn't have told us. Unless, of course, he knew you wouldn't believe the truth, even if you told it to you. They can be the most bold and open-minded people, full of spontaneity and ready for adventure. But they often play devil's advocate and get caught in debate. What are you doing? No, what are you doing? What are you doing? No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Captain gives orders on the ship. The weak points of the ENTP are introverted feeling and extroverted sensing, which means they are unaware of their own emotions. Their convictions can change on a dime. Well, I don't feel as bad as you look. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, kid. You're all right. That's some face you got, though. I think they got a clean for that. <laughs> no, you're great. So they might switch between contrary opinions, even complete opposites, without much hesitation. There are only two acceptable haircuts in my household. No hair, because women don't need to have hair to be beautiful. And all hair, because women don't not need to not have... Hold on. Women don't not do... Women don't not need to have hair to be beautiful and may even advocate for things that are blatantly against their own interests. You can have the boat or the mystery box. What, are you crazy? We'll take the boat. No, no, not so fast, Lois. A boat's a boat, but the mystery box could be anything. It could even be a boat. You know how much we've wanted one of those. Then let's just... We'll take the box. We'll take the box. You gave up a boat for free tickets to a crappy comedy club. More importantly, however, they are completely oblivious to their surroundings. <laughs> ENTPs are often known to joke and banter during moments that should be serious. I got a jar of dirt, I got a jar of dirt, and guess what's inside it? And they also tend to be seriously invested in things that most would consider of little importance. One of the strangest topics of obscure online lore is the discrepancy over whether the Fruit of the Loom logo ever contained a cornucopia. It's an example of the Mandela Effect, a phenomenon where many people's memories do not match up with reality. The strong points of the ENTP are extroverted intuition and introverted thinking. They have a consistent train of thought, but more importantly, they get swept up in a multitude of beliefs, projects, and schemes. For better or worse, they analyze and tinker with everything. The ENTP tends to be the archetype of the mad scientist or the crazy genius. Someone who is almost smart by accident, making things up on the fly. Duck season! Wabbit fever! Duck season! Wabbit fever! Wabbit season! Duck fever! Wabbit season! I say it's duck season and I say fire! Yet somehow, they always seem like they have a plan, even when they clearly don't. Do I really look like a guy with a plan? Or I just do things. ENTPs don't really have character arcs. In fact, they are more likely to learn the opposite of what they are intended to learn. But of course, they'll then end up pressing the wrong button or tripping over something and accidentally saving the day anyways. So I guess it all checks out and works out in the end. Despite their flaws, it is admirable to see someone who can always think outside the box. The ENTP can be a secret genius who knows what's really up. Or they can be insufferably wrong and irritating on purpose. The contrarian is always looking for something new to make fun of. If she ever kisses you, I'll turn you into a prince. Y you will? Prince of the land of stench! 